is a robot. He is the, it was the first guy of a new generation of, of robots. The thing is, he's fully compliant. So if you bump into Roboy, usually the human being breaks uh, his arm. But here it's actually Roboy. Because it has like material properties that are very, very soft, Roboy will break uh, his arm. And then when you glue it together, the arm is a little bit longer or a little bit shorter, but still with these about 50 motors, Roboy is still able to operate his body. So it's not the classical way to build robots like with if, then, else, because it's such a fuzzy, messy body that the, the neural network behind has to be really, really smart and self-learning. So this is a new generation of robots that is fully compliant and can interact with uh, human beings because he's not dangerous, right? And he actually looks cute. He has this baby skin, like a huge head. He even can make uh, red cheeks. He can like, blink with the eye. I can show you afterwards. And you can like, hug him and he, it, it, doesn't, it doesn't crash down. So although it was built 2012, he's very robust and it still works kind of. Is Roboy networked? He's actually connected to uh, talents around the globe. So when you ask a question to Roboy, talents in the background hear that, an algorithm dispatches the question to the right expert, and Roboy speaks in, in the Roboy language the solution, and human beings have the impression he's so smart, but actually there are human beings in the back uh, writing down solutions. So in a way, he's connected, yeah. And he has thousands of Facebook followers and friends. Uh, uh, people actually don't know on Facebook, is he really intelligent? Or is it kind of fake? Of course, it's all fake. It's, it's not like that. The real, I, I'm really skeptical about AI, but it's state of the art in robotics 2012. <laughs>